Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Us here at Yasmar Productions are so happy you can join us as we are about to embark on an absolute epic journey across several states that's gonna have our final destination in Moab, Utah. We feel like we've been planning this trip for years and the fact that you get to join us makes it that much better. So we have a mini series event coming at you. If you're ready, sit back, buckle up and let's go. So although Moab, Utah was our final destination, our first stop was gonna be in Ridgeway, Colorado, where we met up with our good friend, Chris, who drove all the way down from Maine to join us on this adventure. What do you think, Chris? A little deep? Uh, yeah, it's a way, little bit past my calf. That's probably too deep for the Jeep. Well, not going in dry. <laughs> Now none of us had had the opportunity to visit this beautiful state until now, and we were so happy that this was where we chose to meet. Surrounded by tall snow-capped mountains in every direction, we easily could have spent our entire vacation right here in central Colorado. And so, of course, since we were up in the mountains, we had to take some time out of our day and play a little bit. It seems the new JLs have a traction control system that you just can't turn off even when you want to. But while we were playing, a random passerby decided that they wanted to give it a shot as well. Traction control, I was in four low. Traction yeah. control still kicked in. Yep. 
stopped me. I'm like, I, I can feel it. It just yeah. sucks your power right out of you. Yeah. That's my. Yeah. Yep. As we wrap up this part of our adventure, we are going to miss these mountains and this beauty that surrounds us. But tomorrow morning, we're going to get up early. We're going to head out, uh, make a stop in Telluride and uh, do some shopping. And then we're going to head over to Moab, Utah, where it's going to be a little warmer for us. And uh, definitely some beautiful scenery of a different scale. But so excited that you're joining us and staying with us. So come on, let's head out to Moab. Rocky Mountains out in Colorado. It's what 35 degrees outside. Snow on the caps. What do you think? Having fun? Having fun, but it's freezing cold. It's freezing cold. We should definitely pick a warmer time of year, but man, is it gorgeous up here, right? Right. Wow. Totally breathtaking. Completely different than what we see in the desert outside Vegas. Nothing? No? No comment? Okay. All right. <laughs> what the purpose of this gate is. Uh, obviously, if you exit, you may not come back. We're trying to find a place to eat in a mountain town this late on a Monday night during a pandemic. It does not seem to be working. Sad face. Oh, look at that. That would be hard to shingle too. After a little bit of exploring and walking, we were finally able to find a place that was open and allowed us to come in and sit down and eat. morning and welcome back to the channel folks today is day four of our epic road trip adventure we're still in beautiful colorado kind of got hung up here it's a gorgeous state it's a little chilly this morning about 30 degrees or so but we're going to be heading to where it's a little warmer we got one more stop to make in a beautiful telluride as we want to do some shopping and get some food and then we're heading out to moab so if you're along for the adventure we'll get chris out of the pool and uh we'll hit the road you ready Let's go.
just doesn't get much better than this. Absolutely beautiful. Not sure why it took us five years to plan a trip like this, but man, this is gorgeous. final turns down the mountain pass and to our destination, Chris, unfortunately, got a little distracted and ended up off the road just a little bit. Your front tire's not touching either. Watch your rack. You're good. You got there. It's an eco flow solar generator. We got a four by four crew. Yeah, what does it do? It powers our refrigerator for 12 hours, keeping our ice cream fresh. Wow, 12 hours. That's incredible. As our time in this state slowly comes to an end and the sun chases down over the horizon, we know that tomorrow morning we were going to be in Moab, Utah, but we really just could not let the beauty of this state go.